Hi, I'm Alex from Lumatech, and this is the Razor Light Bar. I'm here to show you the Razor Light Bar today. Uh, the Razor Light Bar, as you can see, is a very low profile, sleek looking light. Uh, it packs a big punch at 10,000 lumens. Um, so the Razor was designed specifically for the marine space. The light is constructed of die cast aluminum with a proprietary powder coating process to ensure the durability of the light through 2000 hours of salt spray. So when I say that it was designed for the marine space, all those attributes are, are key to that space, right? So we want the light to look like it's a part of your boat and that it was intended to be on your boat and as a piece of your boat. Um, as you can see, it, it maintains a sleek, low profile, small footprint, which is unlike traditional light bars that are of a larger footprint and maybe more of a clumsy appearance. So the razor light can be mounted in several different ways. It can be mounted as a surface mounted light. Um, it could be tooled into a hard top at the, at the initial design and build of a hard top um, to make it look that much more integrated. Um, but its natural appearance and its low profile, only being an inch and a half tall, 18 inches long, uh, allows a light to um, be less obstructive uh, in its appearance. Uh, it can allow for uh, other electronic devices that are commonly placed on top of a hard top, such as FLIR cameras and, and radars to be mounted within the same footprint and, and not obstructing those other electronics. Um, so Razor is very versatile in the sense that, um, you know, though 10,000 lumens uh, is a lot of light, uh, there are applications and there are customers that require um, more light. So the idea behind the Razor is that you could stack multiple Razor lights next to each other. Um, so it's common to see uh, anywhere from one Razor light all the way up to three Razor lights. Being as though there is a flood and a spot option, it's most common to see uh, the spot option as a forward facing light to cut down on bow glare. And it also has the versatility of being mounted on the underside of a hard top. Uh, in that case, uh, we have lights that have uh, inverted logos uh, for that specific and intended application. So the Razor light's very simple to install. It's a surface mounted light. It comes with all the required hardware. To determine the placement of your Razor light, First place the unsecured light to the front of the hardtop. Run temporary power to the light. In most cases, this will create bow glare. To remove the bow glare, create an imaginary line between the top of the hardtop and the front of the bow. Now move the razor light backward on the hardtop until the bow glare is gone. The edge of the hardtop will shield the bow area and truncate the light beam. You can now mark the location of the light and proceed with the installation. So the way that you dim a razor light is much like our other lights. It's done over uh, a sequence of toggling. So initially turning a light on would allow for a ramp up period, which could be interrupted at any given point, locking in an intensity. So the razor light is currently available in a white powder coat option. It's available in a flood or a spot optic, dimmable, and only two wires. So there you have it, the Razor Light Bar. Sleek design, small footprint, powerful punch. If you're looking for something different, the Razor might be the light for you. For more information on Lumatech products, please check out our website at lumatechlighting.com. Thanks for watching.